What's up guys, Nico Pila 2 here. And uh it's been a long time. It's probably been I don't know, two years, one year since I made a how to root your HTC Evo. Um but now that like I I got like okay, let me show you my old rooted HTC Evo. It's right here. It's all in pieces, it's broken. It we uh claimed it lost or stolen because like so we could use the screen like uh which now actually was actually useful we use the screen to um i don't know i can't i'm not gonna take it out but we use the screen see like that's inside here one sec light okay boom there's just there's like the out there's a thing right there that's the motherboard and in the middle is like the back for it um yeah, it's pretty cool actually, like to look at and stuff. That's the screen right there, and it's off. And yeah, um, I'm now on my third HTC Evo. This is my third one. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Um, this the my first Evo screen is now on my third one. So yeah. Um. So now I have to wear that case, but I'm not going to right now because, like, I just don't feel like it. So, for this video, I guess I'll just take it off for a while. Um, oh, yeah, and the second the second Evo I got, it wasn't rooting anyway, so I'm glad I got a new one. Um, that one was, uh, what happened to that one? I don't even know. Oh, yeah, it wasn't charging, and that's what happened to this one, too. It wasn't charging, uh, but we claimed the lot of stolen, and the other one we didn't have to pay. Hundred dollars. That one we did because we claimed the lost stolen, and the other one was on under warranty. So this one and uh, uh yeah and also, um this is not on warranty no more because I rooted it. So yeah, if you root it, it, no more warranty for you. So that's something you might wanna check out. But anyway, first. Let's see what I got here. Oh, this it's been a while since I made a video or and since I actually done this, but um I got a new computer and all this, so let's see what okay. First, if you want to do it by yourself, it's a lot easier. Go to htcevohacks.com and I'm just gonna go just to that website without clicking nothing. HTC. I'll, I'll put the uh, link in the description for the page that shows you how to root it. But it's the first one anyway, right here. Um, how to root your uh, gingerbread. So it's gingerbread. Um, it gives you a video. Uh, it's very helpful. So, yeah. Let's see what I got here. Okay, well, obviously you need to uninstall HTC Sync. So let's do that. I think I have it on. I don't know why. HTC um, my bad, I'm sorry. It's TC. Sync. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I guess I don't have it. So that's good. You, yeah, you uninstall HTC Sync. HTC Sync. Um, and yeah, then you dri download these drivers right here. Those drivers, HTC drivers. Download that. Um, there is actually a website where you download all of these. Like you can download this whole file. Let's see where it is. Um, right here is that? Yeah. Well, you download the whole file, and um, you could also go to this video and go on YouTube and look at the link in that video. I'll put the video or that video link in a, my description. All this, so I'm basically copying them, but you know, just so I could show you guys that it, you don't brick your phone, it's real. I guess I will, uh, um, I guess I will just, uh, put up the root right here. So here it is HCC Evo 4G uh, root. So let me extract that. Sorry, I can't, I'm concentrating on the computer. Um, Let's see where is it? Here, let me try to put this thing down where I could still see. No, just one sec. Yeah, right now I'm in my uh, 
living or not living room. I don't know. Okay, one sec. I'm going to my computer. Put it in my local disk. Sorry guys, see, I should come prepared, whatever. Well anyway, yeah, I was just excited that I found my video camera because that thing, I don't know where it went. So yeah, you're going to put it on your drive right here. So, yeah, or not drive, you're going to put it in your uh, local disc. Um, after that, let's see what you need to do. Um, Okay, yeah, okay, okay, of course, turn USB debugging on, and have your phone set to charge only, alright, and then, you're gonna go to command prompt, I, mine's right here, but if you want, you can go to CMD, you type it in right here, go here, and you go, CMD, it's just like, I guess, short for whatever it is. And you go there. I'll put like all these steps in the description, I guess. Like, I don't know. I'll just put the this web link here because it'll be a lot easier if you do that. I'm just, I guess, re like going over it. Um, so you're going to copy that and uh, paste it here. And since this worked, I don't need to do... Um, that because that is if it this doesn't work um so if you don't put it in properly so you have to so just do what i just did and put it in um and put it was in the uh, cd drive or whatever it is i don't know where wherever i put it in just yeah and then you're gonna type in right here a d b space one sec let me plug my phone in over here here's my phone here's my cord no, let's just plug it in. One sec, sorry. This says Windows XP, but I put uh, Windows 7 on it. I like it better. Uh, it's sort of custom, my computer. Anyway, yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. And I also have my name. Boom. Nico Opiella. That's pretty cool. Uh, this is also a Mc, McG ROM. It's it's sense I think I don't know but it's 3.0. You can get also all that off of this website. I definitely love this website. It's one of my favorite websites for uh my phone. So yeah. So what you type in is a adb device. Oh my God! What the, what am I doing? I'm, I'm just not paying attention to that. One sec. Go back here. Enter. All right. Now it's gonna be doing this. Boom. Okay. That's my uh. Oh, what's wrong? That's my code. That's my uh. My the, the that's the uh what's it called the device that's attached. So you can go to mark. And copy this, I guess. Oh, I don't think you need that. No, you don't need that. Oops. You don't need that, but whatever. Copied it anyway. Um, let's see next. Sorry. Um. Alright, then you go to revolutionary.io. Right here. It just it says S off recovery tool, but it roots it. S off is a. Uh, I don't know what it is, but I think it's NAND, if I'm correct, but yeah. And this, I'm sorry, this is only Windows. I should have said that in the beginning of the video. Only Windows. I'm put, uh, what's it called? Here. Let's see. And then a download goes here, but you don't really need that. Because it's, it, it's in, this is included in your other things. So I would just, um, exit this. And you go to generate key. Oh my bad. You fill all this out. Let me go. Uh, let me go. What's it called? Okay. Boom. HTC. HTC Evo. This is what you want to put in. 
in instead of the second one because it's just that's just how it is here because we have a 2.3.3 if that doesn't work then try that that could have been my problem or you could just go here let me show you you can you can go to H boot or you can go to the boot thing where you hold the um oh my god there it is where you hold this down and the power button when you turn when it's off and that will uh, tell you your key and then you hit see the serial number oh yeah you do need it so you want to copy that uh that code that was just there this you want to copy that so what you do is hit whoops you hit mark and then you just like hold your thing like hold that down and drag it until it's that right there and what you want to do is right click and it saves it's to your clipboard or whatever i don't know what's called so you copied it basically and then you do this and paste paste it and then you generate key that's my beta key that's what you need your beta key so then you're gonna copy this boom copy alright and then what you wanna do is um, type in revolution I don't even know if that's how you spell it. Oh, my bad. R E O L U T I O N A R Y. O L. Yeah, I think that's correct. Uh, okay, yeah. You don't put dot I O. You put dot E. X E. My phone's already rooted, but whatever. I guess I'll just do a scan. If anything happens, I will. It does this, and then this happens. Boom. All right. This. Okay. This is what it does. Okay. It, this is what the program is. Um. What the heck? All right. Yeah. This is what the program is, and then. It'll do waiting for device, this, and then it'll say type in your beta key. And then what you do, you paste it. Um, yeah, let me exit out that. Yeah, what you do, you paste it. I'll just show you this. You'll paste it. And then let the magic happen. Let me try something real quick. Okay, yeah. Well, you paste it, and then um, it'll just do it for you. And then when you're done... It'll say, do you want to, um, do you want to, let me see. Oh, shit. Uh, you only need like that. That's it. That's all you need. And, uh, shoot, super user. The super user, you can just download it yourself in the market. It's not that hard. Super user. This is what happens. It'll say, do you want to download, um, and you need a internet connection, flash, flash, clockwork mod, whatever, and you hit yes, you hit uh, Y, and then enter, and it'll download it, and then you uh, basically did it. So, um, yeah, that's basically it. Wow, I hate that. And, um, yeah, so all this will be in the description, like uh, this website right here, this will be in the description. So, um, yeah. Also, I don't do no more Modern Warfare 3 gameplay or nothing because I'm just bored of it. So, if I do, it'll just be, I don't know. But I don't, I won't, most likely. I did get, uh, I have five Moabs, I think, or something like that. Uh, so, four more uh, uploads I could do, but I just don't feel like setting everything back up. So, anyway, all I gotta say is... Nico Pila 2 signing out. Peace.